Greetings everyone, Kenji here at Life of Clay. Welcome back to my channel and also welcome to our new viewers out there. And before we begin, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so you may be notified whenever I upload new videos. And for today's video, I will be making brown and black beetle, my third batch of character in larva animation series. And without further ado, come bring the clay on and let's begin. And let's start with brown. And the usual thing I do, I start out with its body by shaping a foil and wrap it up with a thin sheet of clay. And let me tell you about brown. Brown is a dung beetle that gathers poop. To him, poop is either his food or his treasure. He hates it when other insects touch his prized poop. And he has a long strand of hair on his right cheek. adding those segments on its abdomen. Now I'm adding his protruding eyebrow. I use flattened clay ball for the eyes and adding those eyelids. And now I'm adding its lips using this short noodle-like clay. and adding that tiny mole on his right cheek. It with alcohol to smooth out and poke it with piercing tools for the hairs and for the antenna. And now the head and the body is ready for baking. 
I drill these holes for the legs and the arms. I use bronze wire for the legs and the arms. And I wrap the wires with clay and shape them according to the reference. And as the arms and the legs ready, brush them with alcohol and ready for baking. And now I do drilling on the head for the antennae and the hairs. I use two parts epoxy in attaching these hairs and antennae. And for the spines on its arms and legs, I use a plastic bristles and also for its fingers. And I also attach the spines and the fingers. And attaching the arms and the legs. And for his treasured poop, I use an air dry clay. And for the painting process, I painted the head and the body separately. And I use folk art acrylic paints of titanium white, red, black, burnt sienna, and yellow ochre. And now I attach the head to the body using epoxy.
for the poop, I use burnt umber as a base and dry brush highlights of yellow ochre and burnt sienna. I also attached the small poop on his hand. And for the final touch, sealing it with varnish. I use water-based polyurethane varnish for this. That's it guys, brown the dung beetle is finally done. Thank you everyone for watching and hope you enjoyed this video. The next video is for black, the atlas beetle, so stay tuned and wish you keep watching. Thank you everyone, have a nice day.